Hello again, this is Doug, the Two Minute Gardener, and today I'm going to show you a new type of modern pergola. This is the Toja Grid Modular Pergola. It is a kit you can order online, and one of the great things about this kit is they have so many different kinds of sizes because it's a modular kit. So you can do 10x10s, 10x20s, 12x12s. Definitely go to tojagrid.com and see all the different combinations. So I'm going to show you how the client themselves, they actually did it themselves, didn't use the contractor, but they did this themselves and put together these two 14 by 14 uh, shade structures using this kit. So as you saw in a previous video, we had the concrete patio that we poured. We poured a little extra concrete right where these brackets were getting bolted in. These are put in with four inch lag bolts. And so we've started out by bolting in the post uh, brackets and then put in these six by six posts and six by six beams. These are six by six brackets, which are what you need for the bigger size of the pergola. And here you can see we framed out the beams and the posts on the two shade structures. Again, the, the client actually chose redwood, so these are going to be really beautiful once they're up. They've already been stained. And now they've started adding the top structure. So you start with the six by six posts, then the six by six beams, and then on in between the beams for the roof, you have these beautiful two by six uh, in this case, they chose redwood, but the brackets are for two by sixes, and that's what supports the final part, which are the stringers or the very top pieces. And you can see on this one, they've already finished the stringers on top. These are two by two stringers, and that's what actually creates the shade. So it's basically two by two stringers with a two inch gap. Now, there are lots of different ways you can do this. You can do this with a solid roof and just string it all the way across. You're going to definitely need to do a little bit bigger footing if you do that. And again, go to tojagrid.com to get all the specs on all the different ways you can use this shade structure. But it's a pretty easy way to do it, and it's half the cost of a custom shade structure. These two shade structures cost a total of about $7,000 in material costs for everything. And the client spent about four weekends putting this all together. By the way, make sure to hit that like button if you are enjoying this video about the Toja Grid Modular Pergola. And here's kind of another view of from the underside of the pergola. They did a beautiful job with the redwood here. Uh, it took a while to find all this redwood, um, but they were patient and got a lot of this uh, custom picked. And here's the finished product on the patio. They've actually strung some beautiful cafe lights and put electrical on the post so they can light up the jacuzzi area at night. And you can see it really fits with this kind of modern type of looking backyard with the jacuzzi and the long rectangular lawn that they have going off to one side where they can watch the kids play. And then down below you saw the stepping stones and I did a video on that a few weeks back. So once again, this uh, definitely want to go to the tojagrid.com to see all the different combinations of modular shade structures you could do for your backyard. Well, that's all the time we have for. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the Two Minute Gardener to get more of these videos to help with your landscape. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.